Hi everyone, well, I'm here at a local park, just doing some twilight mineral detecting while we're still in summer. And so I just found a good reading, it was uh, reading 85 on the ID, not too deep. And here it is, as you can see it's definitely silver. It's got pattern on it and it's got Keith. K-E-I-T-H in brackets and uh, there's a bit of a pattern on it too there is a number of some sort inside it don't know if it's 925 or not but I'll clean her up and let you know Hi everyone, here's a video of what I found last night when I went metal detecting with my Fisher F2 metal detector. So I just went to a, a park, it's quite, probably one of the largest parks in my area. Um, and I've just been metal detecting bits of it from time to time. So I found a, a silver ring, it's got a pattern on it and it's got Keith written on it. It's got 725 inside it as well. So we can get it, yeah there it is. 725, oh sorry, 715, yeah, so if you guys know what 715 means, or yeah, so if it's silver or not, pretty sure it is, it looks like silver, and I found $3.40 of spendable cash, that's cool, goes towards batteries, petrol and whatnot, and I found 2 Rand, so that's 1991 South African coin, I'll have to look out what it is. Also found a 1944, 1946, 1962 New Zealand penny, pennies. So it tells me that the park's probably been around since 1940s or later. Found lots of two cents and one cent coins and uh, quite a few ones being hit by lawnmower of the one and two cent coins. So he also found a cricket badge with Bank of New Zealand series written on it. So they play lots of cricket at that park. There's several cricket pitches. So you see it's probably come on someone's shirt. So it's got a little man playing cricket. It's got the New Zealand flag fused into it. So it looks like there's blue, white and red in it. But it sort of probably came out in the ground. Also found this sort of washer screw type thing. Not quite sure what it came off, a bit of machinery or something. I also found another weight. It did have um, some fishing line wrapped around it, but I cut that off. So it's always good to find fishing weights so I can put that in my tackle box when I go fishing. So, yeah, so not a bad haul for a couple of hours. So, yeah, uh, please like this video, please subscribe to Kiwi Metal Detecting, and as always, happy hunting!